Okay, let's get the basics down. First of all, the league structure. Major League Soccer, MLS, is split into two separate leagues, one from the east side and one from the west side, just like Rappers. There are 12 teams in the Western Conference and 14 teams in the Eastern Conference. So, looking at the clubs involved as of 2022, these are the teams in the Eastern Conference, and these are those in the Western Conference. Now, the teams in each conference play each other team in their conference twice, once at home and once away. Then they play each team in the other conference once each, making a total season of 34 matches. It's easy. The team with the most points at the end of the standard league season wins the supporters' shield. The next stage takes the top seven teams from each conference into the playoffs. Now, this isn't like the British League playoffs where you determine who gets promoted as there's no promotion or relegation in the MLS. With the winners of each conference only entering the competition after the first round of games, 12 teams are pitted against each other with the winners progressing to the next round. The finalists then play to determine who wins the MLS Cup. Now, one of the best things for me about the MLS is that there have been eight different winners of the MLS Cup over the last 10 years. Unlike European leagues, if your team comes seventh in the league, you've still got a chance to win something. Now we've got plenty more to come on the Discovering MLS channel, including explorations of the history, the teams, the shirts, the draft, the mascots, and most importantly, hearing from the fans. So if you're a big fan of any MLS side, I'd love to hear from you. Maybe we'll get you on the channel. See you next time. Oh,